Have you ever wondered what these things do? You're like, oh yeah, there they go. Toggle sync lock. That, that description doesn't help, does it? Let me show you how they can be useful. So sync locks, uh, they're on by default. Basically they are syncing all of these tracks together. They're locked together in synchronicity. That's, uh, that's my explanation. Uh, what it means is when I insert edit uh, something into the track, they'll all move along together. So let's say I've found this clip, I've set an endpoint using the I key, the O key for my out point. I'm gonna use my super duper shortcut for insert. Okay, you can see there it's the comma. Okay, so I'm gonna hit comma and it's gonna insert it, keep it on the timeline. Boom, it worked, but these are all synced together, so they all get a big cut in them and all get pushed along. That's where sync lock can be useful, especially for music tracks or dialogues. I find that's always annoying. You're like, you stop getting pushed along. Okay, and you can click on sync lock to turn it off so he's no, no longer synced with his buddies. Okay, so let's do the same thing. This is a shortcut. I'm not going <laughs> to click the button. You see that? They all moved along and he stays the same. And if you're like, Hmm, what's the difference between just locking the layer? So let's turn sync lock off and just locking the track. Okay, nothing. It'll do the same thing, okay, except I can't edit this now. I can't adjust the volume. I can't do anything. It's locked. So sync lock is like a soft version of a lock, okay? That's a big old mean lock. This is just a little soft lock. So it means I can, you know, it'll insert edit, but I can still grab it and adjust the volume and do other things to it. I find it's quite useful for adjustment layers. Okay, so let's create an adjustment layer. Where are you? Yes, 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 in the wrong bin, fine. Stick it on there. I know that my sequence has to be 30 seconds long, so I don't want you to move, go like that. But because he's got sync lock on, and I hit my shortcut, okay, the comma to insert, it gets pushed along and cut up. So I can say, you have sync lock off, I get to click on my adjustment layer, you know, adjust my say Lumentry or whatever I've applied to the adjustments layer. I don't have to keep locking it and unlocking it, but that's what it does. Often I just fall back on locking it, uh, except for the music track, it's quite handy just to sync lock that one, or at least turn off the sync lock. <laughs> does that make sense? Another good use for it is when you are, if you're a fan of using the Ripple Edit tool, we'll look at that later on, but if you click on this and let's say your dialogue, you don't want it to move, it's timed with things down here, but you want to trim this up a little bit, do you want to trim it up? But see, oh, the audio comes along, you're like, stop moving along. It might be images or things up there, something else. Okay, but again, sync lock means I can still edit these, okay, but they're not affected by the ripple edit. Look at that, they just stay where they are. Like a mini lock, but they remain editable. All right, now we know what a sync lock does. All right, uh, I've come back from the future. Uh, I've come back from the captions video to add to sync lock because this is a really good use as well that I didn't think of when I made this video. So we've got captions along the top, which we'll discuss later on. Okay, so we've learned sync lock is if I hit uh, my insert, okay, from source monitor to enter here, I'm gonna insert it, push everything along. You're like, okay, not that. I want that to be broken as well. Okay, and if I insert it, it's gonna push the captions along. Like, no, 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 the captions need to stick along with the audio. Okay, so I'm gonna say, you break the sync lock as well. So now when I hit my comma, it pushes them along. These stay in place without having to lock them. Okay, I can still lock them. Okay, but it means I get to work on my captions, adjust them without having to unlock them, lock them again. You get what I mean. All right, I'm going back to the future. You carry on with the next video.